Prosecutors on Monday raided the homes and offices of former and sitting executives at broadcaster NBC, looking into allegations of political bias. A former NBC president and two others are suspected of working with the National Intelligence Service to make news reporting more favorable to the former Lee myung Park administration. Kim Hye-sung has the details. The former president of Korean public broadcaster NBC Kim Jae-chul appeared at the prosecutor's office Monday afternoon to cooperate with investigators in recovering data records from mobile devices. Speaking to reporters outside, he denied the allegations against him. In the morning, prosecutors had raided the homes and offices of former and sitting executives of NBC, including Kim Jae-chul, who led the company from 2010 to 2013. The others targeted in the raids were NBC's sitting vice president Baek Jong-moon and the head of an NBC affiliate, Chon Young-bae. The three are accused of political meddling in news production by working with Korea's spy agency, the National Intelligence Service, to oust reporters, producers and TV celebrities critical of the then-president Lee Myung-bak's government. The Seoul Central District Prosecutor's Office said the raids yielded various documents and mobile devices. Investigators also raided the Office of the Foundation for Broadcast Culture, which oversees NBC, and the Office of a National Intelligence Service official who allegedly engaged in illicit activities with the NBC executives. A probe by the NIS task force on rooting out corruption found that the spy agency drew up a document in March 2010 that focused on carrying out a major personnel reshuffle and scrapping programs deemed left-leaning upon Kim Jae-chul's assumption of the broadcaster's top post. Hundreds of unionized employees at NBC and KBS, another public broadcaster, went on strike simultaneously last month, urging their chiefs to resign and calling for independence in news production. Kim Hye-sung, Arirang News.